Primary School Math Olympiad, Geometric Challenge 1. Triangles. This is a challenge for Primary School Math Olympiad for questions related to geometry for triangles. There are five questions. The challenge is to complete them within 25 minutes. If you can't achieve it the first time, do not be disheartened. With practice, if one works hard and revise this challenge multiple times, one should be able to complete this challenge within 25 minutes. Question 1. The diagram is a parallelogram A, B, C, D. Point E and F is the midpoint of B, C and E, D, respectively. The shaded area is 10 cm squared. Find the area of A, C, D. Question 2. The diagram is a triangle ABC with an area equal to 60 cm squared. The ratio of AD and DC is 3 to 2. E is the midpoint of AD. Find the shaded area in centimeters squared. Question 3. The diagram is a triangle ABC. DB and DC split by bisecting angle ABC and ACB respectively. EB and EC bisect angle DBC and DCB respectively. Angle A to angle D ratio is 1 to 2. Find the value of angle E. Question 4. The triangle below has sides with length of 90 cm, 45 cm and A cm. The value of A must be a whole number. How many different triangles can be derived based on different possible values of A? Question 5. A, B, C, D is 1200 centimeters square. Find the size of the shaded area. The A, Y to Y, B ratio is 1 to 2. The C, Z to Z, D ratio is also 1 to 2. Answer for question 1. Let's assume the area of the parallelogram A, B, C, D is equal to Z. E is the midpoint of B, C, thus triangle E is equal to half Z. As F is the midpoint of E, D, thus triangle A, F, D is equal to one quarter of Z. Triangle E, C, D is equal to one quarter of Z since its base is 0.5 of the base of parallelogram A, B, C, D. As F is the midpoint of E, D, thus triangle F, C, D is equal to one eighth of Z. Triangle A, C, D is half Z. Thus the shaded area is equal to half z, minus one quarter of z, minus one eighth of z, which is equal to one eighth of z. As such one eighth of z is equal to 10 centimeters squared. Triangle ACD is half z which is equal to four times one eighth of z. Thus the area of triangle ACD is 40 centimeters squared. Answer for question two. Since the ratio of AD to DC is 3 to 2, thus the area of ABD is equal to 3 over 5 of 60, which is 36 centimeters squared. The area of DBC is equal to 2 over 5 of 60, which is 24 centimeters squared. Let's label the shaded area Y and the area DFC as Z. Y plus Z is equal 24. Thus Z is equal to 24 minus Y. This is your equation 1. Z is also equal to two third of Y plus area of AED. We also know area of AED is equal to half of ABD, since E is the midpoint of BD. As such, we have Z equal to two over three, open bracket, half Y plus 18, close bracket. Simplify the equation, you will get Z equal to one third of Y plus 12. This is your second equation. Combine equation 1 and 2, you have 24 minus y equal to 1 third of y plus 12. Work out the equation, you will get y equal to 9 centimeters squared. Answer for question 3. Assume angle A is A, as such angle D is 2A. Assume angle B is 4B, and angle C is 4C. For triangle ABC, you have A plus 4 sets of B plus C is equal to 180 degrees. This is your equation 1. For triangle DBC, 2A plus 2 sets of B plus C is equal to 180 degrees. This is your equation 2. 
Combine equation 1 and 2, you will get one set of B plus C is equal to 30 degrees. The angle E is equal to 180 minus 30 which is 150 degrees. Answer for question 4. First let's find the maximum length of A. Based on the diagram on the right, you will see that, if we set the maximum length of A to the value of 90 plus 45 which is 135, it will be impossible to form a triangle. As such the maximum length of A is 90 plus 45 minus 1 which is 134. Now let's find the minimum length of A. Based on the diagram on the right, you will see that, if we set the minimum length of A to the value of 90 minus 45, which is 45, it will be impossible to form a triangle. As such the minimum length of A is 90 minus 45 plus 1 which is 46. The total number of possible triangles is therefore equal to 134 minus 46 plus 1. The plus 1 is to count the value of A equal to 46 too. The number of possible triangles is 89. Answer for question 5. Split the diagram into two triangles by adding line BD. The area of triangle YBD is two third of triangle ABD is AY to YB ratio is 1 to 2. The area of triangle DBZ is two third of triangle DBC as CZ to ZD is 1 to 2. As such the shaded area is two-third of ABCD, which is 2 over 3 times 1,200. The result is 800 centimeters squared. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.